One love, welcome to the feedback loop. I'm Naeem. Just wanted to make an update on the remote viewing December 2020 project, which is a precognitive remote viewing project where I'm attempting to gain perceptions on news events of the upcoming month in advance. So in November, I published a remote viewing session on November 21st, um, describing my impressions for major news events of December 2020. Uh, in it, I described, and I want to show you here on my website, uh, thefeedbackloop.info. Um, you can see the post is in the link description, uh, in the description below. Um, in my first session for this month, uh, I had many perceptions. One of them was, uh, as I highlighted here, a strong sense of life and panic, emergency situation, many voices, people confused, they feel lost, they're running, moving in different directions. I hear people saying, like, you know, what are we going to do? They feel like they're looking for a way out of somewhere. Um, I wrote, I got a sense of explosion, although that may be a misinterpretation. It's hard for me to put the separate gestalts together. So I had a sense of people panicking over some kind of explosion. Uh, at that point in my, uh, I wrote after looking at my data. Um, another impression I had here, which is listed right after, was I see a hill stroke mountain land feature, smoke cloud above, low rumble. Um, and I said, I question volcanic or tectonic. I didn't, I don't see any magma or burnt people. I don't think it's a volcanic event. This is my, um, this is me looking at my data uh, on November 24th and writing a little bit about it. I want to show you those data points here. So um, in my first session, this is in my early data collection phase. You can see here, I had blowing and echoes, hot, um, hissing, vegetation and land, um, a, a dusty, cloudy uh, texture, you know what I mean? So um, I ended up looking at that later in my session. Um, but first, I ended up seeing people. You know, here's the people, panic, loss, confusion, emergency, lost, something feels deserted, um, frugal and desperate, looking for a way out. Um, so I thought, okay, let me uh, look at the, um, the air thing, you know, I mean, the dust or whatever, the cloud. And that's when I saw this land feature here. It felt deserted and distant. Um, I, I got a sense of explosion and low rumble, and I wrote down here, tectonic stroke volcanic. Um, so that was my visual there, and I uploaded that session on November 21st. Um, so uh, I saw it just this morning, but this story broke a few days ago. Um, Indonesia, thousands evacu evacuated amid rising activity in volcanoes. So ash has been spewing out of a couple volcanoes uh, in Indonesia. And um, here it is on global news, thousands evacuated. And I just wanted to play the a little bit of the Al Jazeera report here. This is uh, December 2nd. On Lombata Island in Indonesia's southernmost province, this is Mount Ili Lewotolok. Thousands usually live on the slopes of the volcano, accustomed to its quiet grumbling close to their homes. But days ago, a large eruption triggered panic among the local population. Ash shot more than four kilometers into the sky. People fled their homes and sought shelter. I was so scared. I fed my goats quickly and took off to the town. The volcano is still highly active. Authorities have closed the nearby airport and set up a safety zone. There were still eruptions this morning. Every time it happens, there's thick smoke coming from the volcano. Emergency shelters are providing food, blankets and medication. So I just wanted to show you that there. So, you know, panic, um, frugal, people feeling frugal. Um, had to, they kind of blocked off this area and ev evacuated it. Um, so uh, if you want to read more, check out the full details there uh, on my site, thefeedbackloop.info. You can check that out here. Uh, did a little, um, a little short write-up on some of the data points. 
Um, so yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, interesting perceptions here, volcanic activity. Um, that one was, uh, that wasn't, so, you know, <laughs> that was something I was like, you know, is this going to really happen? But uh, there it is. So um, thanks for watching, y'all. One love.